kidneys filter the blood, and the kidneys do it in quite a fascinating way. Kidneys have, have certain needs for, that, for them to be able to eliminate effectively. They must have water and whole salt also need to be kept warm. Or the kidneys also need us to exercise. As Dr. Barbara O'Neill has talked about how the kidneys are an important part of our health and we have a responsibility to protect them. Dr. Barbara O'Neill has talked about what helps protect the kidneys, so what about foods that weaken our kidneys and need to be avoided? Join us in today's video to learn more about foods that the kidneys should avoid along with evidence from experts. Your kidneys are screaming. Avoid these 10 toxic foods today. Imagine sitting down to enjoy a nice dinner with your family savoring every bite, when suddenly, you feel an intense discomfort in your lower back. The pain is sharp, and it's hard to ignore. Now, picture this happening frequently, disrupting not just your meals but your entire day. That pain? It could be your kidneys trying to tell you something isn't right. Did you know that 37 million adults in the United States suffer from chronic kidney disease, according to the National Kidney Foundation? And what's more shocking is that most don't even realize it until it's too late. Your kidneys play a crucial role in filtering toxins from your body, and what you eat could either support their function or slowly poison them. That's why in today's video, we're diving deep into the 10 toxic foods you should avoid to keep your kidneys safe and functioning at their best. Together, we'll uncover how certain everyday foods can cause serious harm to your kidneys without you even realizing it. Ready to learn which foods are silently harming your kidneys? Let's get started, and be sure to comment if any of these foods have surprised you. 1. Processed Meats Processed meats like sausages, bacon, and deli meats may offer delicious flavors, but they pose significant health risks, especially for those over 50. These foods are packed with high levels of salt, preservatives, and unhealthy fats, all of which can harm your kidneys. According to the National Kidney Foundation, a single 50-gram serving of bacon can contain up to 700 to 900 milligrams of sodium, which is over 40% of the recommended daily intake. Consuming such high sodium levels raises blood pressure, placing more strain on the kidneys as they work hard to filter out the excess salt. Over time, this strain can weaken your kidneys, potentially leading to chronic kidney disease CKD. Additionally, the saturated fats in these processed meats contribute to heart disease, further exacerbating kidney issues, especially for older adults who are already at higher risk for heart and kidney problems. Research shows that individuals consuming high-sodium diets are much more likely to develop kidney disease, particularly as they age. It is better to use fresh, lean meats that you can prepare at home, giving you full control over how much salt you use. Cooking from scratch not only reduces the burden on your kidneys but also helps protect your overall health. Small dietary changes can make a big difference, especially in the long run. But what happens if we look at other hidden dangers lurking in our everyday foods? 2. Canned foods Canned foods might seem like a quick and convenient option, but few realize the significant harm they can cause to your kidney health. Similar to processed meats, canned foods are often packed with high amounts of salt to extend their shelf life. This leads to fluid retention, increased blood pressure, and puts extra strain on the kidneys. According to the National Institutes of Health NIH, we should consume no more than 2,300 mg of sodium per day, which is about a teaspoon of salt. However, some canned foods can contain up to 1,500 mg of sodium per serving, covering more than half of the recommended daily intake. Your kidneys play a key role in maintaining sodium balance in the body, but when they are tasked with handling excessive sodium, they become overworked. Research from Harvard Medical School shows that individuals who consume large amounts of canned and processed foods are at a significantly higher risk of developing chronic kidney disease, CKD, over time. To protect your health, try swapping out canned vegetables for fresh or frozen alternatives. Fresh vegetables typically contain lower sodium levels, and frozen veggies often retain more nutrients because they are frozen at peak ripeness. A helpful tip to make your week easier is to spend some time meal prepping on weekends, reducing the need to reach for quick but unhealthy canned options during busy weekdays. 3. Soda Who doesn't love sipping a cold soda on a hot day, right? However, those sweet, fizzy bubbles are more harmful than beneficial. Soft drinks are not just loaded with sugar, but also packed with artificial colors, sweeteners, and preservatives, all of which place a heavy strain on your kidneys. 
Research shows that just one 12-ounce can of soda can contain up to 39 grams of sugar, which is about 78% of the recommended daily sugar intake for adults. Consuming too much sugar can lead to weight gain and diabetes, both of which are major contributors to kidney disease. From a scientific standpoint, drinking sugary beverages causes blood sugar levels to spike, forcing the kidneys to work overtime to filter out excess glucose. Over time, this constant filtration process weakens the kidneys, especially in individuals with pre-existing kidney issues. The American Diabetes Association, ADA, warns that frequent soda consumption is strongly linked to an increased risk of chronic kidney disease, CKD. Quick tip, instead of soda, opt for healthier drinks like herbal teas, sparkling water with a slice of lemon, or unsweetened iced tea. If you're craving something sweet, consider using natural sugar substitutes like stevia to cut down on refined sugar intake. Next food in our list, are you ready to learn how even everyday bread could be causing issues for your kidneys? 4. White bread. White bread is a staple food in many households, but its impact on kidney health is often overlooked, especially for those with compromised kidney function. This bread is made from refined carbohydrates, which can cause a rapid spike in blood sugar levels shortly after consumption. When blood sugar levels surge, the kidneys are forced to work harder to process the excess glucose, adding strain to an organ already under pressure. Moreover, white bread has a high glycemic index GI, making it particularly risky for people with diabetes or those at risk of developing the condition. Diabetes is one of the leading causes of chronic kidney disease CKD, as elevated glucose levels gradually damage the delicate structures within the kidneys, reducing their ability to filter blood and remove toxins. A study from the National Institutes of Health NIH, revealed that diets high in refined carbohydrates not only increase the risk of diabetes but also directly contribute to kidney damage, particularly among older adults. Another crucial aspect to consider is the lack of fiber in white bread. Fiber is essential for regulating blood sugar levels and promoting digestive health. Without it, your body struggles to manage glucose, leading to more frequent spikes in blood sugar. The absence of fiber also increases the risk of heart disease and obesity, both of which can further exacerbate kidney problems. To protect your kidneys, consider switching to whole grain or whole wheat bread. Whole grains are rich in fiber, which helps stabilize blood sugar levels and reduces the burden on your kidneys. Additionally, they provide essential vitamins and minerals, supporting heart health and digestion in the process. Following white bread, another seemingly nutritious food that can be harmful to kidney health is eggs. 5. Eggs Eggs are often hailed as an excellent source of protein, especially egg whites, which are low in cholesterol. However, for individuals with kidney concerns, eggs, particularly the whites, can pose a hidden risk. Egg whites are high in phosphorus, a mineral that healthy kidneys can filter out easily. However, when kidney function is impaired, excess phosphorus builds up in the blood, leading to a range of health issues. This phosphorus buildup can cause several complications, particularly for bone and cardiovascular health. Elevated phosphorus levels force the body to bind the mineral with calcium, leading to the calcification of soft tissues and blood vessels. This condition, known as hyperphosphatemia, is linked to increased cardiovascular risks and can also contribute to weakened bones, making life increasingly difficult for those with kidney disease. According to Mayo Clinic, managing phosphorus intake is crucial for individuals with compromised kidney function to prevent these severe complications. If you are concerned about kidney health, it's wise to limit your intake of egg whites. Instead, Consider incorporating lower phosphorus protein sources like fish or chicken into your diet. Balancing protein intake from various sources can help reduce the strain on your kidneys while ensuring you maintain a healthy and nutritious diet. Always consult your doctor to tailor your diet to your specific health needs. 6. Avocado Avocado, with its smooth green skin and creamy flesh, has long been a favorite food due to its high nutritional content. It is a rich source of vitamin K, vitamin C, and healthy fats like omega-3, beneficial for heart health and skin beauty. However, avocado also contains a large amount of potassium, a factor that poses potential risks for those with kidney issues. Potassium is an essential mineral that helps maintain electrolyte balance and supports heart and muscle function. 
while consuming potassium-rich foods like avocado is beneficial for most people, for those with impaired kidney function, potassium can become an unwanted burden. Scientifically, when kidneys are damaged, they lose the ability to effectively remove excess potassium from the blood. This leads to potassium buildup in the body, which can cause serious heart problems, such as arrhythmias or even cardiac arrest. Research from the Mayo Clinic shows that managing potassium intake is crucial for those with chronic kidney disease. Hence, despite its nutritional benefits, avocado should be consumed with caution by individuals with kidney issues. If you love avocado but are concerned about potassium levels, a small tip is to limit your portion sizes. Instead of eating large amounts of avocado, you can opt for alternative protein sources like eggs or low-potassium legumes. Pairing avocado with high-fiber foods can also slow the absorption of potassium into the bloodstream. This way, you can still enjoy the benefits of avocado without worrying about your kidneys. After understanding the potassium issue from avocados, let's move on to another nutrient-rich food that also harbors hidden phosphorus, a mineral that kidney patients need to be particularly cautious about, dairy products. 7. Milk and Dairy Products Milk and dairy products like cheese and yogurt have long been known as excellent sources of calcium, essential for maintaining strong bones and preventing osteoporosis. Dairy is not only a staple in many diets but also a key ingredient in various nutritional plans. However, what many may not realize is that dairy products also contain high levels of phosphorus, which can become a serious issue for those with impaired kidney function. Phosphorus is a mineral crucial for bone and tooth formation, but when kidney function declines, the ability to remove excess phosphorus from the blood diminishes significantly. This can lead to elevated phosphorus levels in the bloodstream, causing harm. Phosphorus buildup weakens bones and may contribute to arterial calcification and cardiovascular issues. Studies by the National Kidney Foundation have emphasized the importance of phosphorus control in the diets of people with kidney disease. To minimize phosphorus intake, consider switching to lower phosphorus dairy alternatives or try plant-based milks like almond, coconut, or oat milk. These options not only provide nutrient-rich alternatives but also reduce the strain on the kidneys while protecting bone health. If you still wish to consume dairy, look for products with controlled phosphorus levels or consult a doctor to adjust portions accordingly. Now that you understand the impact of phosphorus in dairy, Let's move on to another common food item filled with potentially harmful ingredients for the kidneys, cookies and pastries. 8. Crispy Cookies and Sweet Pastries Crispy cookies and sweet pastries are often the go-to snacks for many, especially during relaxing afternoons with tea or coffee. However, for those with kidney issues, these treats contain several ingredients that can do more harm than good. Cookies and pastries are high in sugar, salt, and saturated fats, three factors that can severely damage the kidneys if consumed in excess. Scientifically, sugar is one of the leading causes of diabetes, a major contributor to kidney failure over time. When blood sugar levels rise, the kidneys must work harder to filter out excess glucose, leading to long-term damage to kidney filters. Additionally, the salt in cookies and pastries raises blood pressure, putting stress on the blood vessels in the kidneys and forcing them to work overtime. Saturated fats are also harmful, contributing to obesity, another key risk factor for kidney failure. To mitigate the risks from these snacks, consider replacing cookies and pastries with fresh fruits, unsweetened yogurt, or low-sodium nuts. If you're craving something crunchy, whole grain, sugar-free, or oatmeal-based cookies are healthier alternatives. With a clear understanding of the dangers posed by cookies and pastries, next, We'll explore another food group rich in nutrients but harmful to kidneys, red meat and protein-rich foods. 9. Red Meat The kidneys are one of the most vital organs in the body, responsible for filtering and removing waste. However, consuming certain foods can place significant stress on the kidneys, especially for individuals with impaired kidney function. Among these foods, red meat has long been recognized as a valuable source of protein and essential nutrients. Yet, for those with kidney problems, red meat poses a considerable challenge. Although protein is essential for growth and cell maintenance, its digestion generates a large amount of waste that the kidneys must filter. When consuming too much red meat, the body produces substances like urea and uric acid, requiring the kidneys to work harder to process them. 
For healthy kidneys, this isn't a problem, but for those with kidney issues, decreased filtration capacity causes toxins to build up in the blood, leading to fatigue and worsening the condition. The reality is that red meat, particularly beef, lamb, or pork, provides the necessary protein but creates an increased burden on the kidneys. To reduce this risk, experts recommend switching to easier-to-digest protein sources, such as chicken, fish, or soy products. These foods are not only gentler on digestion but also contain less saturated fat, reducing the risk of heart disease. After discussing the impact of red meat, let's explore another potentially harmful food for the kidneys, high potassium foods, specifically peanut butter. 10. Peanut Butter Peanut butter, with its rich and creamy taste, is a favorite snack for many. Known for being a good source of protein and healthy fats, peanut butter often appears in breakfasts or snacks. However, for individuals with kidney disease, consuming too much peanut butter may not be a wise choice. The reason lies in its high potassium content. While potassium is essential for muscle and heart functions, when the kidneys cannot efficiently remove it, it accumulates in the blood, causing serious heart problems, even fatal complications. When the body absorbs potassium from peanut butter, the process happens quickly. In healthy individuals, the kidneys can remove excess potassium without difficulty. But for those with reduced kidney function, controlling potassium intake becomes crucial. Instead of completely giving up peanut butter, kidney patients can opt for low-sodium or low-potassium versions, and if possible, switch to almond or cashew butter, which contain less potassium. This highlights that even foods we consider healthy can pose risks if not consumed properly. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with friends, and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss out on more tips to improve your health. In summary, ignoring these vital tips could have serious consequences for your health. Neglecting to make simple changes could lead to long-term kidney damage and other serious conditions that may not be reversible. The advice in this video is practical and easy to follow, but the choice is yours. You can take action now to protect your health, or you can wait until it's too late, when not even doctors can help. While you're waiting for the next video, the four on your screen right now are tailored just for you. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.